Hi, hello everyone. We're starting a new project, and this one I think is interesting. It's a upgrade of the wiring system of a very complex heating system. Very complex, I mean, there are different uh, sources of heating combined, and we're trying to put it all together in one single controller system. We're using Genius Hub. Very happy we used before, and for you to understand a bit more on here, we had a, a, a traditional uh, four way channel programmer here. We're going to remove, in this case, we've got a solar panel, we've got a cinder, boy at the back there. there there's a bit of, uh, bit of stuff here behind. But for the control side of the thing that I want to discuss with you is we're going to have two two channel receivers, which we will separate the controls for radiators. Uh, we have underfloor heating, we have tower rails and hot water. We're going to have a smart electric switch to control as well the immersion heater. So on the press of a button, he can turn on the immersion heat in case of a failure of the gas or anything else. This system has got as well two on the floor heating systems. Yeah. Uh, one over here, one upstairs. We have two wiring centers connected to uh, electric switches, powered by uh, linking two wireless room thermostats, which will control, in this case, this room has been labeled a day room and this study upstairs. So the underfloor heating as well is gonna be controlled by the same system by the uh, by the, the app, which is gonna be downloaded by the client. And as you as we walk around the property, I'm just gonna show very quickly the existing wise room thermostat that's gonna come out. We're gonna store a new wise room thermostat for the underfloor heating. This area is underfloor heating. But well, you see, that, that will complicate things in the normal installation. You've got wet underfloor heating here, and then you've got electric underfloor heating in the kitchen. And this system can take it all. Yeah. Uh, the electric underfloor heating is here, the controller, with a probe going to the floor. We have a, a, a proper powered room thermostat designed uh, to deal with this. Yeah. And it's also come labeled so there's no mix and match issue. There's no issues of getting confused. On top of the underfloor heating, the electric underfloor heating, the immersion heat to print together, we've got all the radiators as well. This property has got 15 radiators. And they're gonna have their heads removed. We're installing the smart heads. So these smart heads here, uh, should I do all this? I just want to show the label. It come already with indication which one it is. So there's not much to go wrong. They're going to control the temperature of each radiator. So the client will have a full description in his phone or app uh, of which room he wants to hit up and when. And you get that sorted. A part of this, there's something interesting as well. Uh, there's no more need for room thermostats anymore they, because each radiator will have its own thermostat. Each, each radiator will have its own uh, radiator valve, which is a thermostat as well. So it's a clever one. But on this one, for example, we've got a whole entrance, which is this radiator plus two over there. In this occasion, probably we're going to choose one to be the master one, controlling everything. So I want to probably choose this one, which is far away from the wall or from the outside door. The same thing in this room. We have one radiator at the back of the room here, which we're gonna put the valve. We've got the valve right there on the floor. And another one near to the outside window. This air gets cooler and we decide to have our room controlled temperature sensor on this one. So this is gonna become the master one. The yeah. existing head comes out and then the smart one comes in. Already labeled. And then you can see uh, uh, the display, where you put the, the batteries and so on. The beauty of this is mixing different technologies, wet on the floor heating, electric on the floor heating, a radiator, 
an immersion heater and hot water and town rails, they're all going to be controlled um, for the system. And what is amazing, is, you know, there's a part of the control that you gain is the savings. Uh, the expectancy on this already to start with a property like this is about 20 25 percent savings because the client will start to learn how to use the controls and how to operate the rooms to hit up where is necessary when is necessary um, so that's it now i'm going to just introduce to ronaldo hey ronaldo Hello. <laughs> ronaldo is jumping into it straight away and we're happy thank you very much take care